Do you want to learn 3D animation but can't afford expensive 3D animation software? Not to worry, in this video tutorial I'll show you how to download and install Blender 3D. Blender 3D is awesome and the best 3D software animation I have ever used. Ok, let's go ahead and open up Google Chrome. And inside Google Chrome I'm going to type into the search Blender 3D. So type in Blender 3D into Google search and you're going to get to this website here, blender.org. I'll put a link to that same website in the YouTube description so you can access it from the description as well. So here we can see that the first long-term support for Blender 3 series is here. So discover Blender 3.3 LTS. So let's download Blender 3.3 LTS. Let's go ahead and click the download button. You can also click this button to see what's new in this application. I'm gonna click the blue download button and as default, the software or the web browser understands which operating system I'm running. So I'm running Windows, so it's giving me the option to download Windows version. But you can click on the drop down and select other versions um, or for other operating systems such as Linux, Mac OS, and so forth. So select the relevant option that belongs to your operating system, then click the download button here. So let's go ahead and click that. And we have to wait a few seconds and then Blender will start to download. It's around 231 megabytes, so it's not a tiny file, but it shouldn't take too long to download. I'm going to open up this folder on my desktop while this software is downloading. It's almost finished, so we'll be a little bit patient. And uh, don't forget that you can also donate to the Blender Foundation, so just help them to improve the software. It'd be nice if you can make a little donation if you have a bit of spare change. Let's go ahead and close down the web browser and we will double click on this file. And we can see Norton's has scanned it and it's telling us it's safe to install. So we're gonna start the installation process. Let's go ahead and let's see, let's wait for this to give us the option to click the next button here. And we'll accept the terms, we'll click continue. We're gonna install it in the default directory which is on the C drive program files. This is the normal place to install it. We'll click the install button. We just have to wait for this to complete installing and then we'll launch the software just to make sure everything is working correctly, right? So it shouldn't take too long to um, actually install this software. Before continuing this tutorial, it will be awesome if you can hit that like button. You can also support my channel by simply subscribing and hitting the bell icon. Many thanks. Okay, Blender is finished installing, so we're going to click the finish button here. As default, it puts a little icon on your desktop. I don't like icons on my desktop, you can see they're super clean. Um, but we can go to the start menu here, we can type in Blender and we'll get the application here. I'm just going to right click on it and pin it to my taskbar, so that's really all the normal applications that I use, I normally like to pin them to my taskbar. Let's go ahead and launch Blender. Let's just make sure that we can see things are working as we expect them to work. So if you're not familiar with Blender, I'm actually going to quickly show you some of the tutorials that I've made in a moment, but we'll just use the default settings. So we just click um, save, save new settings here, just click save new settings. And then we're just going to go to general and we've got our cube, our default camera, right? Just the standard stuff that we normally have in Blender. And um, if you're not familiar with Blender or you don't really know how to use it, I've made lots of tutorials. So this tutorial is really to explain how to get the software installed on your computer. It's not really a tutorial on how to use Blender. If you want to learn how to use Blender, what I'll do is I'll put a link in the YouTube description uh, to my playlist. So if you go to my YouTube channel, if you head over to the video section here, in fact, go to playlists, playlist right here. And if we have a look here, we should be able to find Blender uh, or we can press Control F to find and we'll type in Blender. Let's just scroll down a bit more. It might be a bit further down. Let's see if we can find Blender in here. So it's right down here at the bottom, Blender 3D. So if you click view, uh, full playlist you can find all the tutorials here there's about 160 videos right so there's a lot a lot of content in here uh, for blender lots of different tutorials lots of different things that you can experiment with create lots of different animation sequences and so forth uh, just go through and experiment click on some of these tutorials this one here is very popular this 3d particle animation one this one's quite a popular tutorial and it's actually a very good tutorial to learn the basics of Blender as well. So I'll actually put a link to that same one in the YouTube description. So I'll put a link to this whole playlist and I'll also put a link to uh, this particular tutorial here. Let's just click it and I'll copy that link so you can actually um, go ahead and watch that tutorial 
as well. Okay, so that's how you go about installing Blender 3D onto your computer. Let's close down this window. Okay, so that's the end of this video tutorial. I hope you found it useful. Don't forget to check out my YouTube channel where you can find over 750 free video tutorials on a wide range of software applications. And I look forward to seeing you in the next DCP web tutorial.